What is up guys, Hava here and today I'm going to be showing you how to create this super easy peephole transition inside of Final Cut Pro X using only one transition. It's super easy to do, it takes like a minute and here is how you do it. So if we take a look at the raw footage, this is it right here. I basically just move back, go to where the peephole would be and go through the door and then stop. After this, I close the door and then I go as close as I can with my camera to the peephole so I can try and see out as much as possible what I would be seeing on the other side of that door. From there, I just move back from the peephole at the exact same speed that I originally was moving back with and it creates a shot like this. Now when you go to edit this, you'll need one cut right before the transition is about to start, so right here. Click B and cut. And then you need another one right where it's about to start on the other side. So right when I start moving, right here, I will click B again and cut that. And then you can delete the center section. So now I have something that looks like this. It comes in and boom, cuts. The cut is very obvious and does not look great in this instance. So we wanna smooth this up. So I'm actually gonna be using a transition for this and the one I'm gonna be using is called Smooth Zoom Out Tool. And this one just looks like this. It's perfect for this instance. And if I drag it in, you can see that it does the job exactly how I want it to. But you'll need to download this transition because it does not come with Final Cut Pro. So all you have to do is go to the link in the description below and it will take you to the website where you can download this plugin. It's made by this guy named Ryan Nangle who makes a ton of really good Final Cut Pro transition and tutorial videos and you can go check out his channel as well. But you can just go down here, download this transition for completely free and when you're done, if you don't know how to install it, you can also just watch this little video here. It shows you how to install it. You can just bring it into your motion templates open it up in Final Cut Pro and you should have this transition there so you can use for this effect. And like I said, that's it. That's all I do. I just cut the two pieces together, add the transition, and boom. It looks amazing. And there's so many different applications to this. I mean, this is coming into my dorm room, but you can also do it, say, coming through your hotel room or any place like that and transition into a completely different location for travel videos or whatever. So anyway, that's it for today. That was just a really quick tutorial inside of Final Cut Pro because I haven't really been uploading lately. So I just wanted to put something out there for you guys. I think it's cool. Go try it. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you all next time.